Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Uh, if you're new and you feel like you want to subscribe, click on the subscribe button and uh, you can join me. My little journey around golf and whatever else I end up filming. So today we've uh, we've done a few tests on some clubs uh, down here at Harvard. Uh, very nice ones let me use their uh, facilities to test some new clubs and some stuff that's been out for a while just to give anybody who's thinking of looking at these clubs an idea of what I think of them uh, not being a pro um, the clubs I'm using, my normal clubs are well, 10, 10, 10, 10, 11 years old um, so yeah we'll start off and we'll, uh, we'll see how we go right. I'm going to start off with the tailor-made P790. Uh, Clusters highs mid trajectory. Big word for that. Morning. Um, this one said the two up, one degree flat, um, with a dynamic gold shaft, and what did I think of it? Nice club, it went about as far as my normal 7 iron does. Um, so obviously my swing is not as fast as other people's. Um, did I feel it was okay? Yeah, it was alright. I would have think about buying it probably, but I wouldn't buy them new. I'd probably wait a few years so they come down in price, but that's if you, you follow my channel you'll know that. I don't like to buy things expensive. But yeah, the P790 can be altered, whether you can see down there or not. So it can be altered to whatever you want. Um, nice looking club and I'll just show you a few shots now of uh, hit it on the range. Right, so you see me hitting a few shots with it. Uh, as I said, it was going about the same distance as my normal 7 iron, which I use. Um, height, probably a bit higher than mine. Uh, consistency was good. More or less the same all the time, which is good, really. Um, besides that, it was a nice little club. So, would I recommend the P790? I would, I recommend you, if you want to go and buy it, you can go and buy it. So uh, yeah, P790, thumbs up. <laughs> 